Hey there, it's Natasha Antonioni with Austin Life, and today we are bringing you a neighborhood tour of Spicewood. What makes Spicewood so amazing is that it's a really developing part of Austin, but the lake or the river runs through here. So you have all these lakefront properties. As with so much of Austin, you have that kind of hippie culture here, but you also have all these new property developments with these beautiful modern homes being built as well. So we're about 30 minutes from downtown Austin, and if you're gonna kind of drive down some of the back roads and get the lakefront, you're gonna be about 40 minutes out. So let's go check out Spicewood, come on. Living Waters is so special because they don't quite call themselves a B&B, &B or a glamping compound, but it's more of a bed and retreat. So it's a cozy, intimate feel here, and it's got space for retreats of many types. Similar to vacation rentals, it's more of a self-catering atmosphere, as opposed to like a hotel 24-hour concierge type of experience. They do have these awesome special packages where you can pamper yourselves, and they have spa employees that will come to the property. And during the construction of their straw bale home, La Casa de Joy, the original owner brought in a group of monks to bless the vial of holy water, blessed by the monks that is buried just beneath the center of the home. Lots of lakeside activities, paddle boarding, boat rentals nearby. Here we are at Stonehouse Vineyards in Spicewood. What's amazing about Hill Country is that they call it Texas Tuscany in that we have almost as many vineyards as we have in Napa. And as an ex-Napa resident, it does feel really good to be sipping a glass of wine next to all of these beautiful grapes and vines. Stonehouse Vineyard is situated on a high bluff overlooking Lake Travis in the Texas Hill Country. They specialize in wines made in Texas, Australia, and California. Beautiful vistas, such a open feeling when you're here and always good vibes when you're staring at a bunch of vines. And right down the street from the vineyard, you have the Barton Creek Country Club at Lakeside and it offers members access to a private clubhouse with a robust social calendar. Always something going on there. An 18 hole golf course designed by the legendary Arnold Palmer, four tennis courts and a fitness center and private members pool. Here we are at Opie's. They have some of the best barbecue in town, but you gotta get here early because it's already not even four and they're sold out. Here we are at Pooties, which is a hub for music talent. This is where a lot of musicians get their start, but Willie is right down the road. Willie's stage manager started Pooties back in the day with a couple of partners, and it has grown into this hub of music right off of 71 so in the middle of Spicewood and they have music seven days a week with COVID right now they are doing a remodel inside so it's going to be better than ever when it starts back and they are famous for their Pooties burger which is hatch green chili and pepper jack cheese so to find out when Pooties is back open make sure to keep an eye out on Pooties.net because this is the place to sip on a beer or a margarita or whatever your thing is and overlook that sunset view on their porch area that is being redone right now. Here we are at a new build in Spicewood. Candace Dickey, one of my colleagues listings at 2300 Kellybrook Road. Come take a peek. This 2565 square foot home boasts three bedrooms and three baths. It's also located next to the legendary Arnold Palmer Design Championship Golf Course. We are in Ascensions where they have five current model homes, a whole development that is being built. And we're right down the street from some beautiful, beautiful vineyards. This house also has an amazing wine cooler and beautiful natural light coming in, surrounded by trees. Smaller lots, but you are in a very natural, beautiful setting. Minutes from the lake. We 
that nice farmhouse shiplap and this detail above the dining table where they've dropped the ceiling and used reclaimed wood. Upstairs, there's a really great, they have it staged currently as a dining area, but it could be great for a media space as well. You gotta check out this outdoor patio. They kind of thought of everything. You have the fireplace out here, which is gas, nice and easy. There's also an outlet here for a fire pit, as well as a hose, which you can imagine if you were to decorate this space, like fill it up with plants all around the edge, except for your beautiful expansive view and have an amazing entertaining space out here. are at the Apis restaurant and apiary. They have an exquisite menu. It is like top of the line, beautiful, beautiful high-end wines as well. So if you're looking for a luxury dining experience, it's definitely happening here. We're right off of 71. They also opened up Soralina, which is a wood burning fire oven restaurant. So the kids can be outdoors on picnic tables, running around, and it's on this beautiful big piece of property. The chef actually started a real community here. They now have a farmer's market and it is like top of the line ingredients from the food that they cook here to all of the vendors that come to this farmer's market. So make sure to check it out. And here we are at Five Soul Wines right next to Front Yard Brewing. So they share this space together. It was just recently developed and it is Beautiful. Look at this amazing space here in Spicewood. Talk about COVID times and needing to get out of the house with a little bit of breathing room for the kids and for the family and some friends. Front Yard Brewing is making its mark in Spicewood with their beautiful brewery. And they've been making beers for quite some time now. They have these eye-catching tap handles that have been selling all over Austin and beyond with their beers like Belgian Blonde Ale, Rye IPA. They even have a coffee milk stout. And because their space is so beautiful and lots of rooms for kids to run and play, tennis courts, disc golf, and they even have house-made root beer for the kiddos. That's a wrap on Spicewood. If you like this video, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe below and make sure to check out Spicewood. It is an up and coming area. Real estate is blowing up out here. You get some space. You're in beautiful hill country, amazing sunsets. It's the next place to be right on the edge of Austin.